The Pakistan Cricket Board, PCB, has suggested three places for the 2025 Champions Trophy. They're Lahore, Karachi, and Rawalpindi. Now the big question is, will India go for the games? This tournament could be a big deal because it would be the first time in about 30 years that Pakistan hosts a major ICC event. Pakistan is actually the defending champ from 2017, and now they've got the chance to host it again in 2025. But this time, the ICC has sent a team to check out the venues and make sure everything's up to scratch. The tournament is supposed to have eight teams playing over two weeks, but we don't know the exact dates yet. The PCB chairman, Mohsin Nakvi, talked about it in Lahore, saying they're working hard to make sure everything's ready for a great tournament. Now here's where things get tricky. It's not just about cricket, it's also about politics. See, India and Pakistan haven't had the best relationship, and that affects whether India will play in Pakistan or not. The final decision might come down to whether the Indian government gives the green light for their team to go. Pakistan hasn't hosted a big ICC event since way back in 1996. There have been times when teams were worried about safety, like after 9-11, and when the Sri Lankan team got attacked in 2009. So if everything goes smoothly, the Champions Trophy could be a big deal for Pakistan cricket. But hosting such a big tournament means they need to get their stadiums in top shape. Some of them haven't had a makeover in ages. Nakvi says they're planning to get international help to fix things up. It's going to be a tough job, but they're determined to make it happen. Plus, it's not just about the Champions Trophy. Pakistan's got a busy schedule with other matches too. They've got South Africa and New Zealand coming over, and they need to find time for their own league, the PSL. So, yeah, lots to do and not much time to do it in. But if they pull it off, it could be a real boost for cricket in Pakistan. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our latest cricket content. And hey, if you enjoy what you see, give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. We love hearing from you.